did y'all get in here? <laughs> Wait, let me think. Because I did leave my door open. Did one of my kids let y'all in? Oh, hey to all my new subscribers. Welcome <laughs> to throwing down in your gown in my kitchen. Y'all, today, I am, look at me smiling, because I am just so happy to see y'all. Today is Friday, and I'm here, and I see that y'all here with me, so should we get started? But first, y'all already know, do somebody else want to do it for me? Go ahead, let me see, let me hear you. Okay, let's do it together. Gown check, gown check. Who do I see? Look at my supporters. Cook it with me. Hey, hey, hey. Cook it with me. Y'all, so today we are going to cook some Rotel. How many of y'all have Rotel? Yo, was it good? Okay, because you know what we throw down in our gown in this kitchen? Everything is going to be tasty. <laughs> so let me show y'all what y'all need. So first and foremost, y'all going to need a pan. Duh. And then you're going to need a meat smasher. And then you're going to need some ground beef, turkey, whatever you prefer. Um, then you're going to need some Velveeta. I put cream cheese in mine. I also put hot jalapeno peppers in mine. Let me put these in the fridge. So jalapeno peppers. Um, and then I'm also going to add some, because I love me some extra sharp cheddar cheese from Wisconsin. Yeah, I love cheese. So I'm, I'm going to add some of this in there. Y'all know why I ain't got no sense. <laughs> I'm going to add some of that in there. And then for my Doritos, I mean for my chips, I have hot, flaming Hot Doritos. I have yellow tortillas. And then I just have the plain, let me show y'all, the plain nacho cheese Doritos. Y'all remember when these chips, let me see, because these chips right now, oh, the stores and the government just makes me sick. But anyway, that's neither here nor there because ain't nothing going to change. But anyway, these chips right here are $6.29. Like, what? But if you catch them on sale, they two for nine. So I caught them on sale today. So I was like, let me and my gal gang make some Rotel today while these chips are on sale. Because what? What? So, and I'm also going to add some black beans in mine and, of course, the Rotel. So, let's get all, get, get all your stuff together. Get your pot, your pans ready, your pot ready or whatever you want to call it. Um, we're going to start browning this ground beef. Okay, y'all, so get your ground beef. And, yes, you do see a new pot set right here. Y'all, I'm going to show y'all the set at the end of the video. But it's called Koroika, yeah, however you pronounce that right there, that's what that is. They're so nice. I'm going I'm to let y'all know how they cook when we done cooking. So let's put our ground beef in. Okay, Y'all know I'm going real simple today. I'm doing my, y'all, I must have reached for this. And listen, where's my Larry salt? But I got another one, y'all already know. So let's put the rest of this little Larry salt up in there. You see it ain't none in there. I think that's all I'm going to need too, actually. I got my new one right here. And we are going to brown our meat. Oh, let's put a little pepper in there, too. Got the fan blowing, blowing my seasonings everywhere. 
Okay. And let's brown this meat. Brown your meat and let's meet back up. While our meat is cooking, y'all, we just go ahead and um start chopping up your cheese. So I did mine. That's my Velveeta. I did like half because if I do a whole one, I think it'll be um too much. And then I also undid my cream cheese. And we can start opening our cans up. Make sure y'all wiping off these tops. Please and thank you. So wipe off your tops. So y'all, I got for my Rotel, because I like mine a little spicy, like me. <laughs> Say so. Oh, okay. So I got the um the fire roasted, but I also got the original. So I'm gonna mix these together. I got four cans. So hopefully they they it's enough. And then I got some black beans. I got a taste with some beans. I don't know why. Ain't it crazy how your body be craving weird stuff? It's crazy, but it's whatever. Okay, so go ahead and chop up your cheese. Undo your cream cheese. Sit it to the side. Um, you can add a little more seasoning to your meat if you would like. Meat is all almost done. So go ahead and do that. Clean up your mess because y'all already know we clean as we go. Stop playing. On this channel right here, yeah, we cook in cleanliness. Clean, clean. You know what I'm trying to say. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, y'all. <laughs> we'll meet back up in a minute. Okay, y'all. So I drain my meat. Now we're going to add our... um our cheese so we can melt it down get that all melted up in there melt your cheese and we could go ahead and throw the cream cheese in there as well Let this melt down, and I'll be back. Okay, this is what this should be looking like. Cheese mixed in, cream cheese melted. Let's go ahead and throw our Rotel in. Be careful with the can. One. Put our garbage in there. Oh, y'all, that roasted one, this one, the fire roasted, oh, that smells so good. Let me get a, um, thing. Because my meat is all mashed up, so I don't need this no more. So you get all your good stuff from in, in between there. Okay. Oh, excuse me. I'm about to turn that down some. Y'all remember what I told y'all? Always use um, silicone, especially on your, your pots. If they new, if they old, always use silicone. It won't scratch your pots up and you'll keep your pots and pans for a long time. Okay, y'all. I think I'm going to put in... Um, one more of the fire roasted. Or should I? Let me see. I don't think I need to. Yeah, I don't think I need to. I wanted to, but 
We're going to throw some of these beans in here. What is all this stuff on my stove? Y'all know I don't like that. Over here flicking meat. Throw the uh, black beans in. I drained them as well. Y'all, this is about to be some amazing. <laughs> These pots cook really well, y'all. Really well. I'm going to show y'all the whole set. They cook very well. can't stand a messed up pot. I can't stand a messed up pot. If y'all out here buying $200 in gym shoes and all this other crap, but your house supplies ain't right, yeah, you need to figure that out because what you cook with just makes your food taste better. So, stop buying all that other expensive stuff and start getting you some expensive pots and pans. So, when you cook it for your family, you cook it right. I ain't going to tell y'all that no more. For real. But, I think this is done, y'all. I'm going to let this simmer some so my beans could get nice and done. What I should have did was cook my beans in a different pot, but ain't nobody got time for that. Okay, let me throw my cans out. Y'all, this is about to be good. Oh, y'all can't even see. Let me bring y'all down, my bad. Yeah, this is about to be something real delightful. I really don't need no more cheese in here, but... I like cheese. So I'm just going to sprinkle a little bit. That's good. And I'm not going to put the um, jalapenos in here because everybody might not want jalapenos. But I'm definitely going to put them on my, in, my, in my serving. Yes, I am. Okay, y'all. Go ahead. Go ahead and clean your cans and stuff up. And I hope y'all draining y'all um, oil. Like I mentioned. Always drain your oil. Never drain your oil. Never drain your oil inside your sink. You talk about something that's going to be clogged up. Plumber got to come. What, the, what are you doing? Always drain it in a bowl. Always. Okay, y'all, let me put this stuff up, throw my cans out, um, well, recycle and recycling, and then once I do all that, I'm going to plate my food, and we're about to do a taste test. Y'all ready? Because I'm ready. <laughs> okay, y'all, I'll see y'all in a minute. Okay, y'all, so here's the set right here. Here's the Rotel in this pot. So it came like 10 in a set. Very nice, very nice pot set to cook in. So I just had to show y'all that <laughs> before I did this taste test because your girl is hungry <laughs> and always get you a cute glass. Cheers. Always get you a cute glass. Oh, that's good. 
that's good. That's um apple cranberry. So good. Okay, y'all. Oh, let me put my jalapenos on top of mine. I'm only going to put a few because y'all know I don't eat a lot when I'm on here. Because I be trying to sit down. Okay. I put like four on them. My kitchen is clean. And yeah, let's see. Let me bring y'all down just a little bit so y'all can see me. Here it is. So I got the tortilla chips, my jalapenos on top, and then the rotel. Let's see. And then you come back, talk about, let me taste it first. Huh? Here. Is it good? You already know. Okay, let me try it. Let me try it. Oh, my gosh. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Y'all, yeah, this is good. I know I say that every time. That's because every time it be good. Mmm. 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 Oh my goodness. The jalapeno. Just give it that. Oh. Uh. So good, y'all. Oh, let me slow down. Oh, it's clogging my throat. Oh, because I'm eating too fast. Let me slow down. Let me drink some. If I end up choking on camera. Oh. Y'all, this is good. We did it again. This ain't called throwing down to my gown for nothing. We get it in. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, y'all. I'm about to end this video. Oh, so I'm watching this series. It's called From. It's on um Prime Video. They say it's on Prime Video, but then you got to click it. Cause it's on MGM Plus. They always trying to get a dollar. But anyway, I've been watching that. My son got me hooked to that. I'm almost done. It's so good. Y'all need to watch it. It's called From. So good. Mm. 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 Y'all, we need to open up a business. Because me and you... We do it every time. It never fails. Put it in the comments. And let me know how y'all's turned out. Or if you tried it before. Leave a comment. Don't be scared. It's me. Don't be scared. Leave a comment. Share this video. Like this video. Subscribe to this channel. Y'all know what to do. Hit that post notification bell. I don't say it because y'all should already know what to do. So, thank you for coming to throw down in your gown in my kitchen with me. Mm -hmm. Until next time, y'all. Until next Friday. I'll see y'all then. All right. Peace.